And we are back in this tomb. This godforsaken tomb. A broken glass plate. What is it doing here? I should examine it at Baker Street. Ooh, I think it's that negative. Oh, very peculiar. An ice maker. Why would Sir Rodney have brought such a device here? Mithras, the god, clothed in Anatolian costume and wearing a Phrygian cap, killing the bull. I hear something. This fresco resembles either a ladder or a hierarchy. Ooh, maybe someone's part of this cult. Judging by the broken orbit, this poor fellow met a death similar to Sir Rodney's. This shoe is not from the Roman era. It is medieval at best. This man was a tomb raider who met with an unfortunate end. By the eye he was punished, for he saw that he was not worthy. Dreadful. <laughs> that was the same line he used before. This game likes to do that a lot. They like it, they like to take um, character models and, and phrases and stuff and reuse them. The fire casts a shadow upon the floor. Are we not going to talk about the pillar made of skeleton heads and bones? That is the symbol of Neptune, the god of the sea. It resembles a bull. The pillar collapsed a long time ago. Well, that's not good. Right, before I do that, let me see if I can get anything else. Okay. Oh. He can see that just by the damn. This shadow seems to represent a bridge. Hmm. Oh, last one right here. Right? Or did I already do this one? Nope, not yet. It is very similar to the face of Mithras. The shadows show us the way to go. We will find Mithras after Neptune, the bull, and the bridge. Hmm. No, it's this way. That's right. It kind of turned around. Mummified bodies. We are in some type of catacomb. We cannot go any further. Mummified bodies. A shovel, not from the Roman era. Huh. 
search the tunnels. <sighs> Thought I did. So there's one more thing here. But what? Mummified bodies. We're in some type of... What should we do next, Holmes? I don't know. Why don't you think of something for once? Jeez. Why do I keep him around? He just... Lays around and does nothing. Sometimes helps me get back... You know, back up on my feet after I take some poison. That's about it. Oh, the tell's done. Okay. Oh, no, no, that's not. Jeez, it's the second one. I keep saying to search the tunnels, but I'm pretty sure I searched everything. I'm going to go back upstairs. Or climb upstairs, I should say. A sack of crude salt. There we go. Thank you. What am I doing? Let us try to create an object from silver by using the mold. It will take a minute to melt the silver with my gas burner. Done. Now mm. I can proceed further. Liar. Mold is hot. I should wait for it to cool down. Done. Now I can proceed further. A homemade silver knife. Excellent. We have created a knife with the silver that we found. It could have been used to kill Sir Rodney. It was extremely clever to create a weapon that could dissolve at the scene of the crime. Well, yeah. Oh, can you rotate it at all? No, you can't. Okay. Ugh, I'm sucking. Okay, hold on. This goes right here in the bottom for sure. No, this doesn't go... It goes up top and not where I think it goes. Can we move it? No, we can't rotate it at all. That sucks. Where's the other part of his body right here? Right? Ah, 
What am I doing? Where's the top part of his head at? Is that it right there? Yeah, that looks like it. There we go. There we go, we're getting somewhere now. Hmm. Not too bad. Done. Watson, could you please use this negative and your photographic equipment to process the photograph? Yeah, sorry it took so long. Thank you, Watson. Now I must use reagents to develop the photograph. Sir Rodney, ice, salt, another archaeologist most probably, the pyramids of Giza in Egypt. Oh, right here. Ice cream in the desert. <laughs> we are indebted to the Romans who developed the technique. Ice cream. So that's it. Salt and crushed ice may help to create ice cream. She's gonna make ice cream in there. <laughs> ah, check to see if an ice knife. See, I think I said something like that not too long ago. Come on, guys, give me credit. Give me credit. Okay, so we still don't know where those ones go yet. That's why I think. Oh, because that makes sense with with the water and the blood. If I wish to shape the ice knife, then I need to pour water inside the mold. But where would the metal come ice, from, though? Ice, salt, and then the mixing. It should be elementary. We need to reach minus 20 degrees Celsius to fully freeze the water inside the mold. Before beginning, I must remember that I have enough ice and salt for no more than four attempts. A block of ice. Oh, ice pick. Oh, look. The temperature is reducing.
What the heck? Get down. I totally messed up. <laughs> okay, let's try this again. Let's I try it again. Oh, yeah, water first. Ice before beginning. I must remember that I have enough ice. Yeah, yeah, I get it now. Oh, look, the temperature. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's go, let's go. You can do it. You can do it. I believe in you. Excellent. Now we must check to ensure that it is adequately frozen. An ice weapon for a cold-blooded murder. <laughs> An ice knife. A surprising and yet a very brilliant idea. It's the perfect weapon. It enables one to kill a man and then it melts. The only trace it leaves is a small puddle on the ground. I, I you see, that's why I think uh, it comes together. And the champagne, so who brought the champagne in? That's what we have to figure it out. I like where this is going. See, the silver weapon's nice and all, but I, I like that. That's why I kept thinking, too, that they used uh, an ice weapon. Okay, well, that's it. We need to visit somebody. Ah, that's right. We had a clue there, right? Wish I could remember how it went. There's Neptune, the bull, the bridge. And then whichever one of the goddesses were. I can see why people use Twitch now, because you can interact with people. I don't, I'm, not, I'm not much of a person who likes. Um, the whole nothing against walkthroughs or whatever I just myself personally I don't watch them let's see I want to do this before I end the video it is a statue of Minerva it is a broken uh, hmm. What can I use the rope for? Oh, then we get the hook. It is a statue of Minerva. Bridge pier seemed to hold a secret. Hmm. What does that mean? 
This railway is used to remove rubble from the site. Okay. Thank you, Sherlock. Ugh, I saw Watson over there and it kind of scared the crap out of me. Oh, yeah. Maybe I'm supposed to go down here, though. And somebody buried that one. Gosh, where am I supposed to go? I don't like being confused. Let's go down here. Can I? Nope. Frigidarium. We may need to go into one of those cabins again. I thought I'd do something with with them, but no. I took that. Oh, that uh, that crossbow. That's right. This is a reproduction of an ancient Greek crossbow. Is that it? Come on, Sherlock. We should use these metal rings to help us reach the bridge pillar. We should... Okay. Oh man, that water is loud. Well, I got the rope. I got the tongs, right? That's why I kept thinking maybe the um, the crossbow is is what we have left, and then we just shoot it across to the uh, whatever that is over there. The door has been left open. Oh. <sighs> I should use the appropriate object. I should I should use the appropriate object here. So this Kidding me? What? Oh, there we go. 
Ah, oh, whatever. I got it. Get ready for some loud water, guys. Those wings on the bridge are perfect targets. See if I can get it. Ah, oh, come on. Oh. The bridge is ready. Now I must cross it. Oh, okay. Oops. I didn't realize I had to shift with the triggers. What the heck? Come on, we can do this. Huh. What the? I'm hitting it. <sighs> Some of these puzzles they do, the, like this, the controls from them, just don't react the way you, or the way they're supposed to. <sighs> See? I'm hitting it. Sound like you're watching. Come on, Watson, come here. I have found something. Oh, <sighs> okay. Now, depending if there's a scene coming up or not, a cutscene, I'm probably going to be ending the video and going to bed. Are we inside the hidden temple of Mithras, Holmes? I am not sure. We had better be careful. So, yeah, that's it, guys. Um, I'm going to end it right here. Go to sleep. Hopefully, uh, you guys like the walkthrough so far. They should all be going up here in the morning and then as soon as I get off of work I'm gonna finish up this game thanks for watching and hope you continue watching all the other ones as we solve these mysteries together later